Welcome Tandem users. In this video, we'll walk you through the recent updates made to our user interface as we continue to enhance your digital twin experience. Our goal is to make interacting with a digital twin more intuitive, empowering non-BIM users to unlock all the great features a digital twin offers. As you'll notice, the viewer toolbar is no longer within the viewer itself. Instead, we've thoughtfully reorganized it into our new header and footer navigation bars, providing a more simplified user interface, making the facility and asset data the focus. Let's start with the profile menu in the top right corner. Here, you'll find the viewer settings. While the settings themselves haven't changed, we've updated how to access them. Now, moving to the header navigation bar in the top left corner next to the measure dropdown, you'll find the viewer controls, which allow you to navigate the model within the viewer. Under these controls, you'll find options to orbit, select, pan, and zoom. Each control is assigned a quick key, indicated by letters next to the controls. Simply press the corresponding letter to immediately activate the desired function in the viewer. Next, the measure menu includes both measuring and viewer sectioning tools. Moving down to the footer navigation, you can activate space and room labels so they are visible in the model, giving you access to the filtering capabilities that accompany them. Lastly, in the bottom left corner, you'll find the visualization controls for our connections and streams features. These allow you to turn on the heat mapping and stream pins, which display the facility stream data. You can view stream pins based on their status and use single or multi-select to quickly customize the viewer according to your needs. When you're finished working in the facility, click the Tandem logo to return to the homepage. Thanks for watching and happy twinning!